Lancashire's club statistician was busy all day leafing through the dusty archives to discover just how many records the Red Rose batsman Neil Fairbrother had broken with his massive 366 runs at the Oval and when Lancashire last scored as many as 863 in an innings. But after his 10-hour innings in the Surrey sunshine, it was back to a more familiar cricketing day for the Warrington-born left-hander as the rain fell heavily onto a motionless Old Trafford scoreboard in today's game against Hampshire. Time then to read those glowing newspaper accounts of the bank holiday heroics. Came off at lunchtime with 100 and the boys said you'll never have a better chance to get 200. So I buckled down and got 200 by just, just as tea time came I got 200. And... Uh, came off feeling pretty good and they said right come on 300's on here all the boys in the dressing room said right Monday morning Archie McLaren scored 425 in 18 something or other and that's a, the English record and the Lancashire record you've got to go for that and Graham Hicks scored 405 so when I went out Monday morning I was very very nervous I didn't think I would be but as we reached the crease I was shaking 23-year-old Fairbrother set four personal records but just failed to beat Archie McLaren's 424 in 1895. He was also a Lancastrian. Fairbrother's name will now join Old Trafford's gallery of cricketing greats. Concentration would be uh, as frightfully important as a batsman. I mean, you've got to concentrate like hell. And uh, naturally, towards the end of the day, you're getting rather tired and your concentration is not quite so good. For Lancashire, though, one record of special significance managed to escape them. I think Lancashire were obviously trying to get there, but just didn't quite make it. And that's the record for the highest county championship score, which I'm afraid Yorkshire hold. Uh, 887 against Warwickshire in 1896. But uh, there might still be a chance to get that again in another game. The delay has given one player the chance to put his feet up and reflect on a superb innings over the holiday weekend that rewrote many of cricket's record books. It was described as a perfect batting track at the Oval, but no one could have imagined how well Lancashire's Neil Fairbrother would adapt. His side were a little annoyed that Surrey had dragged out their innings to 707 for nine. Fairbrother's revenge was sweet. He hit 366 after spending more than 500 minutes at the crease to help Lancashire to their highest ever score of 863. My career best was 164 not out. And last season I got out three times in the 160s and didn't beat it. So the boys had given me a bit of a ribbon about that and said if I didn't beat it this time there was going to be big trouble when I came back in. So that was another incentive to stay out there. Well, it's a fantastic achievement in terms of uh, what a first-class cricketer has done in the county championship uh, and in terms of what an English batsman's done in the history of the game. Sadly, by this afternoon, only two overs at Old Trafford were possible. The 26-year-old left-hander, whose effort bettered Selene Hutton's historic 364 52 years back, was left sidelined, itching to try out that bat again. For Fairbrother, the most vivid memory was on 299. The spinner was bowling and he brought all the fielders were on the edge most of the afternoon and he brought everybody in to stop me just pushing it. Bowled a flat, quick thing first ball so I just patted it back and I decided if he tossed one up he was going to go back over his head. And he tossed the next ball up and I just came down and, and knocked it over mid on. And it went for six as it happened but uh, I wasn't too bothered where it went really. 